Yeah, I mean, it felt good personally. Um, happy we were able to win. Um, but yeah, no, I mean, it, it feels good. Happy to have a good start. So now I got to keep it going. I uh, can get better from it. Uh, but I mean, I just felt good. I mean, I felt good this whole time. So it's been frustrating, but happy to finally have a good one. What was the difference for you tonight? Um, I was just pissed off from the start. <laughs> yeah, I was mad. So probably that. Um, I don't know. I was just attacking the zone. I was just I'm mad at a lot of things. So, yeah. I, has that worked for you before? I mean, being pissed off heading into the game, are, is that something you're able to use to your benefit and, and focus into an outing like this? Have you done this before? Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, but if I can control it, which I could today, and I don't want to hear people be like, well, pitch pissed off more often. That's weak. I don't need to hear that. Um, but yeah, I mean, I just, today, that's what I needed. That's how I felt and that's what I did. But I don't think there's anything, I mean, just today, that's how today was. I was just mad. My, yeah, my game plan was a lot of fastballs, more just read swings, understand what I could do. Um, but I didn't even watch video on them or nothing. I just I need to stop worrying about all this and just pitch. So that was the secret today. I just, yeah, I just pitched. Just do what I wanted to throw and made sure I throw strikes as, like, as frequently as I could. Uh, I didn't throw a lot of change-ups because I missed been striking change-ups. I said, I'm not going to do that today. I don't care. I'm going to throw it three pitches. Uh, and then once my change up won't start acting right and start striking a little more than it, than it had, hasn't been, then we'll be good. So the change up took a break tonight, but it'll be back by the next one. I think, honestly, I just needed to start like this to kind of feel that, feel that fire, feel that, I don't know, just kind of feel what it's like to be myself again. So. To have that again, when I know I feel great, I know everything's good. Everyone else wants to be like, oh, he gave up, what, seven runs last start? Man, oh, he's three innings and all this. You don't know me. Like, I'll be fine. I kept telling everybody I'm gonna be fine. Um, I just gotta get comfortable. Like, it's it's hard. I mean, I'm, a, like, I'm an emotional guy. I left a place that was my home and that I loved. And, Come in here, I try to do a lot of the things I was doing there, but in reality, I have to switch up a lot of the things I was doing to, you know, get comfortable here. Um, and it's taking time. So I think people just got to understand it's going to take time. Um, but I know the pitcher I am. I know how good I feel. So there's a lot to it. But again, there's a lot that I had to learn that I didn't have to learn in Tampa because I was raised in Tampa. I just learned as I went. Um, so here it's, Wait, what? It's been two months and I'll get it going. I'll be, you know, who I know I am. So just relax, keep it easy. I'll, I'll get there. So to have a good start, uh, it feels good, but I got to continue to get better, continue to, you know, work. And like, how, how do you make sure that you, that you take what you did in this outing and build, build on it? What, what do you take from this outing to make sure that you can build on this? Um, yeah, I mean, I take a lot. Um, it's just more of the demeanor, um, the presence. Um, there's a lot, but I mean, you just, I got to go watch. I mean, I know how I felt. I know what I did for the most part. Um, I don't want to give too much away. See, that's why if you're in a clubhouse, we could talk and I could, you know, off record type stuff. We, I could tell you a lot more, but I think just personally, it's, it's mostly just, you know, I, I got to believe in what I'm doing. I got to believe in the pitch that I'm going to throw and I got to execute that pitch. And if I'm able to do that, then that's going to allow me to be, you know, a really successful pitcher. When, how do you put in the words what Manny can do with his arm at third base and some of the throws that he makes? So you've seen it from kind of both ends of the spectrum. You know? Yeah, I mean, the thing, when I see Manny get a ground ball, the first thing that comes to my head is wrong guy. Like, just don't hit it to him. It's... <laughs> It's not going to go your way. I mean, he's amazing. The throws from, you know, down here and um, how he fields everything. It just everything looks so easy and routine to him. It, it's, you know, it's it's really fun to have him over there and, you know, just watch how good he really is. And I, I'm just 
I'm ready to see more of that cannon because I know he could throw 100. I'm ready to see that throw because the throw to second was hard. But when he when I was uh, playing against him when he was in Baltimore, oh my god, that's when he was letting that thing eat. But uh, yeah, no, it's I'm very happy to have him over there on the left side. 